The heroin epidemic is a statewide health crisis that needs to be addressed in a non-judgmental and open manner. A three-pronged systemic framework addressing prevention, treatment, and rehabilitation are key to combating this illness, just like we do every other illness out in healthcare. Not only in Connecticut, it's nationwide that we're seeing the heroin epidemic. Um, it starts out many times with people that are prescribed controlled substance, such as a Percocet or an Oxycontin. Um, a lot of people like that feeling, and they continue to, have, to, to get prescriptions when they don't need it. At some point, they get cut off from that supply. By that time, they're addicted, so they wind up on the streets buying the street drugs, which are you know, twice as much as you would expect. So for a Percocet, for example, it was usually about $40 to $60 a tablet. So they start off with that, and shortly afterwards, they can't afford it anymore. For whatever reason, they use all their resources, and they turn to heroin, which is about $5 a bag for a fix. Um, so it's a very cheap drug to get the same effects. The problem is it really changes your brain chemistry, and once you have that first high, people say they keep chasing it to get that first high again, and it's an addiction. Today, we plan to expand on the immediate need, proposing an act concerning the administration of opioid overdose antidotes by designated first responders. The Percocet, um, an Oxycontin, the heroin, those bind to a receptor in your body. What happens is if that receptor also um, decreases your respirations and that's where we see the overdoses. People just stop breathing. Narcan, when it's administered, it goes on to that same receptor, pops off the narcotic so that you're, it just, absolutely, I've, I've done it in my own practice uh, in the emergency room where someone comes in, you give it to them, they immediately come to. This bill will let uh, designated emergency first responders be able to have this um, in their toolkit when they respond to someone.